Welcome to the MTM Motor Vlog. Make sure you stick around because I'm going to tell you how I got this killer sunburn yesterday. But first, we've got to get some go juice. Oh yeah. <laughs> Remove card rapido. It's one thing I am good at rapid. Yeah, I'm gonna go through the car wash. That's a great idea. Select grade. I'm definitely not going diesel. Nitro plus. <laughs> Well, that's, that's that. See, what I'm going to be doing... Oh, nice U-turn there, boss. What I'm going to be doing here, this isn't going to be replacing my other videos. This, scoop my goose. This I'm just doing because... Well, I love making videos. All different styles of videos. Everything like that. So don't worry, wine fans. I'm still going to be doing wine videos. I just want to get more content. I just want to keep creating. So this is just another outlet for me to create. I'm going to show you my fine town. So I'm actually on my way right now to go shoot a review video for this backpack that I'm wearing right here. So make sure you look for the video before this one. Maybe it's the video after this one. I don't know. It hasn't been shot yet. And, and who knows if I'm actually going to post this. So what I thought I would do here today is I'm going to be going along and as I said, I'm going to go shoot the review video. Why not vlog it? What's the worst that's going to happen? The video's going to suck, which is really not that big of a stretch because, well, most of my videos do suck. So really no big deal. Back to this kick-ass sunburn that I got here. Yeah, well, slight story behind that. My baby here. Yep, here she is. Just turned over a thousand K the other day. So at a thousand K she had to go in for her first service. But as you know, I live here in Parksville. Sweet. I bought the bike in Ladysmith, which is it's about 50 minutes away to an hour, depending. So I thought oh, such a beautiful day. You know, I gotta ride my bike to go get it serviced. So I took it to Mile Zero Motorsports, where I bought it from. Top-notch service. Not paid to say that. I'm just super happy with the service I've gotten from purchasing the bike all the way to getting it serviced. So I dropped the bike off yesterday, which I rode all the way from Parksville. So about an hour in the sunshine with just my vest and my t-shirt on, because look at this. Beautiful weather. <sighs> this dude is like stanking me out with his tar man i don't know if he's gonna go tar and feather somebody but anyways good god i don't know if you guys can see that smoke but anyway so i got to the sh got to the shop yesterday and um there i dropped my bike off and gonna get her serviced and they're like do you want a loaner bike what like i planned on just sitting there all day like not all day for whatever two hours it was gonna <laughs> god damn it I was gonna, I'm gonna have to pass this dude. Like the, the two hours it was gonna take to service my bike. I was ready to just kind of hang out and sit in the sunshine, but they're like, do you want a loaner bike? So they lent me a V-Strom 650. So I took the V-Strom 650 from Ladysmith, and then I just met my wife at the mall in Woodgrove Mall there. Oh, this guy's hauling ass too. In Woodgrove Mall, so I basically drove from Lady from Parksville to Ladysmith, Ladysmith back to Woodgrove Mall, Woodgrove Mall back to Ladysmith, Ladysmith back to Parksville. 
with no sunscreen and just a t-shirt. Oh, it's a fantastic day though. But I'll tell you though, these arms, they paid for it. Cause later that, it was yesterday, um, I, th I took the service in on Saturday. Yesterday was Mother's Day. So I took my wife and my mother-in-law down to the beach club, the resort right on the water there. We actually just rolled past it a couple of minutes ago. And uh, the funniest thing, we're back in the parkade and my wife's like, holy crap, honey, look at how tanned your arms are compared to your legs. Now I wear short pants all the time, but when I'm riding, I'm wearing these vented crash pants because, well, they're vented, they're nice. and. You know the pant antler can get hot on days like this so she was right like my legs are jet white and my arms are like sun-kissed golden red yeah so it was kind of funny that you know that would get pointed out like that so anyways that's how i got some really bad sunburn arms and you're asking yourself well dumbass are you wearing sunscreen today because you're out riding uh negative why? Because I'm stupid. I was in such a hurry to get out and film because I got to get ready to go to work because I'm going to work here tomorrow I leave. So uh, this is my big panic get stuff done day. Hence I'm shooting a video because I got to get some footage out there. So anyways, I'm taking you guys along. Where I'm going to is this little spot called Little Mountain just to do my intro shot which i'm hoping you'll see the video you'll watch it oh damn it there's the turn it's been a few years since i've been up here winter tires oh hell yeah i got them not it's beautiful up here but also i said i haven't been up here for seriously probably 10 years maybe a little less than that so let's uh Let's get up here and have a little luxy loo. Oh, look how steep that is. Oh, the DRZ has a no problem. Yeah, boy. Holy smokes, this is a lot steeper than I remember. That's a nice looking house up there. Should be getting near the top if I remember correctly. Oh, she's out hiking it. So we made the summit here. Oh, damn. Wow, they've really upped their game. I was kind of hoping to get up over there. Oh, with Olympic grace. I mean, seriously. Look at this. Holy crap. I haven't been up here in years. Aerosmith Mountain, Moriarty. Absolute. I forgot just how beautiful this is. So if you're ever in the Oceanside area, make sure you come here. Wow, I forgot. Fun fact, there was a movie filmed down there. Can't remember the name. Hopefully I'll put it up here on the screen. Unreal. Now I'm driving around trying to find a, the best spot that I can think of to film this review. No, this is, this is way too far far I can't I need like a table like ah. Fuck me. electric 
through. Magnetic radiation awakening me. Uh, gonna need some Red Bull to help bring me back. Uh, full dope. just gonna go down to the beach park there yeah so when I did the review for my pelican briefcase I was up in the hills in Penticton I had that wine barrel damn did that thing look that scenery that backdrop ah now I want to do this review this backpack and it's like I just want it to look good so I spend most of my day riding around looking for a spot I'll go see if I can find a good one down here at the beach here nice but oh, look at, do you see that thing just got me it got me right in the arm right in the arm I saw it coming too there was nothing I could do it was committed it's like I'm taking you out sucker you're mine oh tsunami warning well I'll make sure if a tsunami comes to get the hell out of here don't touch my cooler food trucks a fine fine bench if I've ever seen one but some people there I'm still a little too shy to be doing this like right oh my god ladies and gentlemen have I got a show coming right up oh there's a good one oh yeah I'm just going to go ahead and wrap this video up now. Thanks a lot for watching. I really appreciate it. I do. If you made it to the end, hats off. Do me a favor. Can you leave a comment in the description? Jesus, look at those gas prices. Just jumped up another three cents since I filled up. Unreal. Yeah, leave me a description whether you love what you liked about the video, what you didn't like about the video. Because I'm going to keep doing this because I just love making videos and this is just another way for me to make some videos. Also, I'm going to leave a link in the description for my buddy Dean Barber. He's a new up and coming moto vlogger up north. So we've been talking about some pretty cool ideas that he's going to be coming up with. Plus, the guy really helped me out with getting this damn GoPro to work properly. So I owe him a shout out. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. That way you're not going to miss out on any of the action that I've got planned coming up. All you wine fans, oh my goodness. It's going to be big. Thanks for watching.